Here with head coach Lacey Prejean as uh, Northwestern gets ready for conference opening weekend. It's here. It's, it's gotten here quick too. I sure. don't know about your perspective, yes. but yes. we're at week five and we're playing uh, we're playing conference games. But before we talk about Nichols this week and, and all that, um, give me some some thoughts, some perspective on the non-conference schedule. Uh, do you feel like with the, with the quality of teams that we played? Uh, and, the, and the way we played and the growth that you've seen, that you've gotten what you wanted out of the non-conference schedule? Yes. Uh, you know, we played every weekend we were on the road. And so that's tough. That's tough to play on the road. Um, and there is something that holds true to having home field advantage. So I'm excited about being able to play at home this weekend for opening up conference. But, you know, all the way from week one, San Marcos, till, till Austin last weekend, we had improvement every weekend in some aspect of it, whether it was in the circle, whether it was – um, offense, execution, uh, hit and run, stolen bases, um, things like that. So every week I felt like we improved um, improved in some aspect of our game. Going back to that last game in Austin, like you said, uh, really maybe one hit away from, from beating Penn State and going uh, with three and one uh, mm -hmm. all on the weekend. Mm -hmm. Where the way the offense is sort of taking strides, you feel like we're in a really good spot coming into the right. first, first right. uh, conference week series? Yeah, So, and the pitchers did a good job. You know, a lot of our one, two, two lost games, pitchers are doing their job. We're just not, we have runners on, we're just not getting the hit. Same thing happened against Penn State. We had runners on, we just need to get the, the, the key hit. And we, we, we could have won seven more games if, if that happens. But I feel like we're getting better. We're getting the right people up at the right time and they're executing. And, that's that's what the game is about, and that's what the preseason's about, you know. And so coming into conference play, um, there's some high expectations. And um, I just told our, our players, you know, at the post game talk um, on Sunday, I said, you know, the season's broken up into three. There's three seasons: your preseason, your conference, and your postseason. We finished to one. Now we're starting conference. Everybody's 0 and 0, you know. Stats, everything, record, everything is 0 and 0. So, but use what we've learned in preseason, and then make the adjustment once we get into conference. So like I said, uh, playing Nichols uh, in this first uh, conference series this weekend had to had to adjust a little for weather, but still going to mm -hmm. be in here mm -hmm. uh, at uh, at uh, at our place. Yeah. What's the excitement level for you, uh, first of all, to to have the conference opener be at home? Uh, yeah, like in your I first said, season? there's home field advantage, you know, and we have the outfield club. I'm excited about that, and I'm excited that our players get to sleep sleep in their own beds. Their families get to be here, friends, and and our fans get to watch us play and have that home field advantage and. Uh, it's also alumni weekend, uh, you know, so hopefully we'll have a lot of alumni come back and we can honor them as well. So, but to start, you know, this weekend, uh, conference against Nichols and, and it's going to be three really competitive games. Nichols, uh, they kind of a lot like us. Uh, they played a tough non-conference as well. They've got uh, some really, you know, talented hitters and good pitching staff. So what's going to be the, uh, the keys uh, throughout this weekend that you're going to look for that leads to us having the success that we want to have? I think jumping on them early, you know, scoring early, taking advantage of, of when we get runners in, in situations. I um, feel like our, our, pitchers, our pitching will allow us to do that. Um, they're going to keep us in every game. And, um, but taking advantage early, of executing early, of not waiting till later in your second, your third at bat of the game to make adjustments um, if there are adjustments that need to be needed. So that's going to be key. And, um, and then once we, you know, once you start scoring runs, have some crooked number innings, you know, and, uh, and we, our goal is always to, to chase the starter. You mentioned Alumni Weekend. Um, we have a, a big group of some really exceptional players that have come through this program. So how important is, to, is it to you to have this team, the freshmen, just everybody to sort of connect with them and, and really, you know, embrace Northwestern sure. softball yes. and grow from that? This is their program, you know. I'm, I'm here now and, and help guiding that, but this is their program that they've, they've been here four, five, six years, and they've built, and I want to honor them, and I want them to want to come back. And so I'm excited that they're, they're coming back with their families and, and so they can meet our current team, and our current team can know the players that wore the jersey before them and, and to appreciate them. And I want to I make sure they understand how much we appreciate them and the sacrifices that they've done to get us where this program is right now. Looking forward to a great weekend. Uh, it's some good weather once this yes. whatever's coming goes through, sure. and uh, and a good time here at uh, at uh, Demon Diamond. So thanks a lot, Coach. Thank you, Parkham.